Oh, hi. There's a way to start the day. You've been in a lot of the intros lately, haven't you? Good morning, internet. Very late start to today, and very, very late vlog posting yesterday. I am so sorry. I have apologized, and I have apologized, and I have apologized. Shit's just happened, and I'm getting around it. And I hope you're willing to stick around. I'm not even gonna go into too much of a rant. And now I'm gonna tell you that I'm very addicted to this new Facebook game thanks to someone very close to me right now. <laughs> Freaking addicted to this game right now. And I'm gonna be timed again, aren't I? No, I'm not. Okay. Good. Whew. I'm not gonna lie, I... I have to take a break from that game. I've literally been playing it most of the day now. <laughs> most of the day and I'm only on freaking level 18. And the person who introduced me to it sound like level 36 now. I just ate one part of a really good meal and now I'm gonna eat the other part because I'm starving. Hey guys, just after midnight now, I don't really have anything for today. Not gonna lie, today started off really fun and got really sad really quick. Now, now I know some of you will probably say, what happened? What's going on? I'm not gonna dive into too much detail about what happened today, but I will tell you something I've been really, really nervous to talk about for a while, and I've just had enough of, I wouldn't say I'm hiding it or I've been lying or anything. I just, I've just been keeping it bottled up inside. And of all the people I want to talk to, you guys, are at the top of the list. I'm just gonna get right into it. I'm not in the best mood right now either, honestly. Here's the truth. Most of you know about a year ago, I lost someone very, very important to me. And I just haven't felt the same ever since. I put on a strong face for the camera a lot. I put on an even stronger face for my family and my friends and basically I felt lost. Like, one of you asked me a while back during my first Q&A, basically, you asked if I'd ever felt depressed and how I got through it. And at the time I felt it was way too personal and I just didn't want to talk about it. I wouldn't go as far as saying depressed, but very, very lost. I had this all thought out in my head earlier and pulling out the camera now, I just don't even know what to say. I felt lost and confused and just really, really sad. Like I said, I, I usually tend to put on a strong face and smile for you guys and a lot of other people, but and there are genuine times that I have a good laugh and feel happy, but at the end of the day, 22, almost 23, living in my parents' basement, been fighting to keep jobs, just got another one recently, hoping to keep it. Just got my first car about a year ago and struggling to actually get my license. Really hoping I get it this February. <laughs> and I... I'm not going to say how I lost her, because I'm going to keep that between us, but I lost someone very, very dear to me that I still miss. I've, try I've been trying to move on because I know that's just life. You lose someone, you, you got to move on. I'll be honest, I'm not the very best at letting go of things, and I know many people are going to say, well, who is? All of us suck at that. I, believe me, I really suck at it. Like. I still miss the family dog that died years ago. I miss a really good friend of mine that... lost his life. I miss a dog I had to give away. I still miss my grandmother that passed away also, but lately it's just been that special person. It's been a year, 
I don't, I don't even know what to And yes, I do laugh at myself a lot, whether I tell whether I tell a joke I think is funny or trying to make light of a serious situation. I just laugh. I can't help that. I have tried to dumb it down over the years, but I just laugh at my I don't even know exactly where to take this conversation, but I do know one thing. Through everything that I've faced the last few years, I'm gonna say it, YouTube has been my go-to place to remain positive and just fight my battles. Whether it be a YouTuber I know and genuinely admire, or just some random YouTube video that I found from searching who knows what, or simply even talking to a camera myself. YouTube has just been my go-to place, plain and simple. I mean, I have friends, don't get me wrong, I go to my friends. I've gone to my family. YouTube is just my happy place. I don't know if I've ever told you guys, but I also actually suffer a lot from anxiety. Like a lot. I have a lot of anxiety. And you can probably, and most of you can probably tell watching the videos when I'm trying to explain a sentence or I repeat things or maybe I have a certain like physical flaw, whatever. Shit's never really been easy for me, but I've learned to cope with it. And I've gotta say, it really, really hasn't been easy the last year. No matter what, I fight to be a positive person because I don't like to focus on the negatives. I, like, I honestly love helping other people through their negative time. I just don't like negativity, period. I hate it. I hate negativity. It's stupid. The world is full of too much negativity, especially as of lately. Let's be real here. Especially as of lately. The world is just full of negativity, and I'm downright sick of it. I've fought to be positive before, and I'm still gonna fight to be positive. I have rambled for well... Excuse me. Turn. I have rambled for well over ten minutes now, and I still don't have a point. I just... I've felt lost, and I, like many who feel lost, I, like, it's in the name. I don't know what to do and how to get past it. And I'll be the first to admit, I've, I don't like to do it a lot, but I've had my share of tears as well. I've had many, I've, right. If there's anything I can make of this, any of this, really, life is what you make it. It fucking sucks. But, life is still what you make it, and you just gotta try to be positive. You just do. You, you gotta try to be positive no matter what happens. And I'm actually also a man of God. I am. I love God. I am a strong believer. I do indeed, and I do indeed look to God for help from time to time. I am here for you, whoever's watching this. I am here for you. I only hope that most of you continue to stick with me. Stick with me through all these stupid times. Whether I ramble for four and a half minutes to ten minutes and it's about stupid stuff for probably two weeks straight, it's at a Charles Trippy concert, or it's driving to Pennsylvania, or wherever, with my cousin, whatever. I just hope that you guys are willing to stick with me no matter what, and together we can just be positive together. We could just be positive people together. And on that note, I'm going to play a few seconds of a song I haven't listened to in a while, but I feel like would help right now. And a few extra seconds from a YouTube video that still brings me joy. You ready for this? I don't think you're ready for this. Here we go. Seventy. I'm almost seven. You're, I beat you at nine. 
Come on, you I know, just started two days ago. I know, I'm just sad. No fair. It's very sad. <laughs> anyway, subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the internet somewhere. Yeah, I went there. And I'm actually going to leave that as the final note for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching. Please hit that subscribe button if you're new. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Stay awesome. Be you.